What's good, sneaker fam? Welcome back to our sneakers. Before I continue with this video, I do want to apologize for being like MIA for a good week or so. The thing is, I'm in finals week and I've just been busy with that. But now I got two finals to go. Once I'm done with those, I'll be back here for sure. But they'll be easy, so I'll be uploading constantly. The next announcement I do want to make is thank you guys so much for hitting that subscribe button. We are finally at 1500 and that was pretty quick, guys. It surprised me because I didn't think the channel would grow that fast. Just on Thanksgiving, we hit 1000 and today we're finally at 1500 which that surprised me a lot. Thank you guys so much. And just for that, I do want to do something big for you guys, and that is to raffle this shoe off right here. It is the Air Jordan 1 Top 3, and I will be raffling this shoe off for a dollar a ticket. It will be a total of 300 tickets, so once we get to 300 tickets, I will choose a winner, and I'll keep you guys updated as the raffle goes. I'll leave a link down below to where you can get your raffle ticket. By the way, you can buy as many tickets as you want. If you want to go ahead and buy all 300 of them, go ahead. If you can buy 100, whatever, whatever you want to buy, you can go ahead and buy them. And whether you want them to resell or keep, these are seven and a half, so if you guys are seven and a half and looking for the shoe for a good deal, go ahead and join the raffle. And if you're just looking to resell, you can go ahead and make some good cash on this too. Anyways, moving on with the video, we do have today also the review on this shoe. It is the Nike Air Jordan 1 in the top three colorway. And for this review, I'm going to be holding both shoes just because they are different. So basically, this shoe is a mixture of a Bread 1, Royal 1, and a Chicago 1. And as you guys can see, the toe box is a Bread 1, the back is a Royal 1 mixed with the Chicago right in the middle. What I like about this shoe right here is if you cover the toe box, it kind of looks like a fragment one, except it doesn't have a little thing right here. And of course you have the sole of the Chicago or the red one. And this is only on the right shoe. And then you have, you have a white tongue on the right shoe with a red background tag and then the white logo. And on the left shoe, you do have your Chicago one in the back. Kind of looks like the bread toes I'm wearing right now. And on the front, you do have your Royal ones. And the inside of this one, you do have your bread one. So it is a really nice mixture of the top three Jordans. I wish they would call them the what the ones, since it is kind of like the what the ones. I mean, you can call them whatever you want, but in the end of the day, they're officially the top threes. Unfortunately, this shoe doesn't come with any pixel leather anywhere. It's really just basic leather everywhere. It's really one con to the shoe, but it doesn't really bother me just because the shoe is really nice. I would rock this, even though it's so colorful. As you can see, I did get this off Stock X, and I will be doing a review on that tomorrow. So get, stay tuned for that. And this shoe does come with four laces. It comes with blue, red, white, and then a black one on there. And to be honest, I am thinking I'm trying to keep the black because... It is just basic all the way through. Instead of having just so many colors going on, I don't, I've seen reviews where they put these laces on and didn't look too good, so I'm just gonna go with the black. Oh, and I forgot to mention the sole of this one. It is the royal one. Moving on to the insoles, you do have your red Nike Air in there with the white background, and then you have your blue Nike Air on the right shoe with a white insole. Fortunately for me, the price on these shoes did drop, especially the resale, and I was able to pick these up for 190 something dollars because StockX was doing a Cyber Monday deal where you get $25 off your first purchase from StockX and you get free shipping. Anyways, that's enough talking about the shoe. Let's get on to the on feet. But before we do, don't forget to hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Also, keep subscribing. Now the milestone is to get to 2,000 subscribers by the end of this year. Also, don't forget to check the description down below so you guys can find out where to join this raffle for these shoes. Make sure you stay woke. Our sneak is signing out. Peace. You're listening to Redneck.